So today's talk includes many moving gears. And at the core of it all is our head brain and our second brain, the gut. So if you've ever felt butterflies in your stomach before a big presentation, like today, or a knot in your gut after a stressful event, you've actually experienced the gut brain axis in action. But the relationship between the gut microbiota and mental health goes deeper than just a few physical sensations. Now, these are complex relationships, so this talk is by no means the whole story. But before we get into the first chapter, let's start with a preface. So the connection between the gut and mind has been going viral lately, but this knowledge has been recognized for thousands of years in traditional healing practices, such as Ayurveda and traditional Chinese medicine. The Greek philosopher Hippocrates also declared that all disease begins in the gut and let food be thy medicine. I'm sure we've all heard before. But multiple millennia later, Western medicine found that yes, microbes exist, and yes, they can make us sick. Then came Ilya Mechnikov, a Russian scientist who won the 1908 Nobel Prize for discovering how our immune cells fight bacteria. And he changed what we knew about the gut microbiota and health. Mechkinov observed that Bulgarian peasants who drank fermented milk daily lived much longer than other Europeans. He believed that it was the probiotic bacteria that they were consuming that was balancing out bad bacteria that caused inflammation and sped up aging. Mechkinov believed in this theory so much that in mad scientist style, he drank cholera, which is an intestinal pathogen to prove that probiotics can prevent infection. And in this case, he was right. Unfortunately, despite his earlier awards and accolades, this later work was not accepted by the scientific community. He was labeled a quack and his research was basically forgotten for over a hundred years. In 2004, the mood and microbe field was born, and a groundbreaking study showed that animals who didn't have a gut microbiota had extreme reactions to stress with much more anxiety and depression-like behaviors. 